Hallelujah to Jesus. We give God a praise. Let God be exalted in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you. Jesus love you. And I love you. Please finally like this video. Share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you. As you do that in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Glory Abba Father. They are asking serious questions about you. Because you are making a lot of people furious. They are, you are making a lot of people furious. I hear this word so strongly. They are furious because the way you are carving your own way of happiness. You understand? Sometimes we are like, oh, happiness is free. Sometimes you have to work for it. For you to be able to release happiness. Because when you look at the situation of this world. You will not even want to be happy at all. But because God said you should be at peace, you should be happy, you will want, you will carve your own happiness out through the word of the Lord and you will be happy. They see you laughing, cracking jokes. You are dancing. You know, you, the, your happiness is something that is concerning to so many of them right now. Why are you so happy? Why are you still, still laughing? <laughs> When I heard this word, I'm like, wow. So what do they want? Or did they want somebody dead? This is why I tell us that Pharaoh does not stop. When I say people are like, ah, let the mercy of God locate them. Mercy of God will locate them. We pray for that. But it is up to them to accept the mercy of God. The mercy of the Lord and the grace of the Lord, it is made available to all. The forgiveness of God is made available to all. But how many are willing to ask for the forgiveness? How many are willing to receive the mercy? How many are willing to receive the grace? It is not that we are not praying that the mercy of God should locate them. It is because they are adamant, a hardened heart. Their heart is hardened. The Bible says a broken heart, the Lord will not turn away. A, a broken heart. He will not turn away. But there are so many arrogant people who have sold, who are completely sold out for darkness. They cannot accept the mercy. The Bible says that he's at the door of our heart knocking, which is being unbeliever, being a believer. Jesus is always at the door of our heart. He's always knocking. But it is up to us to accept. I always say this parable, you can force a horse to the river. You cannot force the horse to drink water. Hallelujah. You can just walk the horse to the river as if you are taking a walk around. But you can't dip the mouth of the horse and say you must drink that water. You need to understand the water is there. If the horse is thirsty, he will drink. If the horse is not thirsty, he will not drink. If you don't want to drink, he will not drink. There is nothing you can do about it. Hallelujah. People are furious. They are talking about you with anger, with a lot of hatred and jealousy because you are happy. Do you know that I was praying? Somebody said, embarrassing. Because I am praying, you are, you are like, what is embarrassing in praying to God? Maybe they don't accept the God that you are serving, but they pray to their own God. So what is embarrassing now? Me praying to my own God. You need to understand there are people who are naturally bitter because they have no reason to. They don't just have any reason, but they are just bitter because they are completely sold out. Completely sold out to darkness. Yes, you are being talked about. <laughs> you ask yourself, why are you being talked about? I'm sorry for my nose. Why, why are you being talked about? Because you are happy. Many of them are furious. I pray. No power will be able to remove happiness and laughter from your life. In the name of Jesus. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remain your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.